Hey there friends, I wanted to talk about something very important for keeping clean and that's two things actually, washing our hands and washing our body. Why these things are so important is because we play, we exercise, we are silly and we get dirty and what helps us get clean again is to wash our body and wash our hands. How do we do that? How do we get our bodies clean? Hmm. We need two things to get our bodies clean or to get anything clean. And those things are soap and water. Soap and water. So we get our bodies clean by taking a bath or a shower. Some of us use bubbles. Some of us use a bar of soap. Um, we wash our hair. We wash our face and our body, the whole thing from our head all the way down to our little toes. We wash our whole body when we take a bath or a shower. And we also wash our hands all day when we eat, um, when we go outside and come back in, we wash our hands. So I'm going to show you a fun way to wash your hands, whether you're at the sink or you want to make this a job at your workspace. I'm going to show you how to do this at your workspace but you could do it in the sink. You don't need a big bowl or um, to bring your soap to your table. You can go right to the sink. I just thought this was a fun idea if you wanted to bring this to your workspace. Here's how, all right? Here's how we wash our hands. You'll need a sink or a bowl of water and some soap. Soap, ready? I'm gonna move a little closer so I don't spill. All right, and I'm gonna take my soap and push the soap one or two times in my hands, okay? And do we wanna put that right in the water? No, we wanna take our hands and scrub them together. See how I'm getting some bubbles? Oh, look at all those. I'm gonna wash my thumb on both hands. Look, soap's all on this side, but look, I don't have any soap on that side, so I'm gonna wash this side of my hands too. Cover my whole hand in bubbles, my fingers, my nails, the front and back of my hand. Oh my goodness, look at all that soap. Ready, here's how we get it off. You need water next. So I'm gonna dip my hands in my water and rinse them clean. Rinse my hands off until all of my soap is gone. See how I'm getting bubbles in my water? That tells me that I'm doing a great, great job. Means I had lots of soap. Okay, still have a little bit of bubbles on my hands. That's okay. Get them off the best as you can. It's okay to have a few bubbles. My water's pretty soapy. All right. And if you worked on a towel like I did, you can scoot your soap and just dry your hand with the corner. Or if you're working at a sink, you might need mom and dad to help you say, I need a towel. Or you could find one at your sink, see? Oh my goodness, now here's my favorite part, ready? I want you to take your hands and don't touch your face, but you can hold them in front of you Smell them. Mmm, they smell so clean like soap. I love that. Did you smell your hands? Mmm, so squeaky clean. That tells us that there's no germs on our hands anymore. And if you take a bath too, you can smell the bubbles or your shampoo or your conditioner in the tub or in the shower. And those smell yummy too. And then that tells us our body is so, so clean. If we smell nice like soap, our bodies are nice and clean. So I hope you find a way to make your body or your hands squeaky clean today, friends. All right, scrub a dub.